Life is like a big deck of cards. You might have heard that it's like a box of chocolates, but it's actually a big deck of cards. It's shuffled, and it gets picked at random, dealing your hand over and over. Some get a good hand. Some get a horrible one. The story I'm sharing with you, however, is something you wouldn't think to expect. You know the game Solitaire? Yeah, I, I used to love that game. At least until it happened. When I was a kid, I, I rarely had a chance to use the internet. So whenever I had my hands on the computer, the time would be passed with Solitaire. I never won it. It was just really hard to me, even on easier setting. As I grew older, I began mastering the game whether it was one card hand or three cards. And soon I was even close to them before to winning. But I still couldn't. Around the time of my 15th birthday, I almost had the game all figured out, but I still couldn't win. Why was this game so fucking hard? It went all smooth until the last move, and I got stuck completely. I stopped playing for a while, focusing on other games on my computer, such as Minesweeper and Plants vs. Zombies. After a few months, I decided to try Solitaire once again. But as I turned it on, the screen flashed. What I saw for those two seconds wasn't much, but I can remember it. It was a card. A Joker card, to be precise. Blood dripping from the top head's mouth. On the bottom end, it had a malicious grin, holding a blade, crimson liquid dripping. You can probably guess what. Making the corner of the card realistically wet. It was gone as soon as it came, uh, uh, and I began playing. But I got a looming feeling as if something was watching me behind me. Every now and again, as I made a successful move, the screen twitched, the image appearing over and over. As I was close to the end, I made a risky move. The screen froze on the image of the card. Ooh, it was more horrific than it had been the first time. The top part was now skinned, its pixelated flesh looking incredibly realistic. The skin was hanging over the part of the card that separated both sides. The bottom face of the card was gnawing at the skin white flesh of the top half. I looked in disgust and it stopped chewing, only to glare at me with resentment. I fell out of my chair, crawling away from the computer as it zoomed up to the bottom half's face. Its glare got more terrifying as a grin spread across its pixel ugh, its pixelated face. It couldn't speak, but the words at mouth were loud and clear. You won't win. Just like all of the other times. My eyes widened and I began to shake. My mouth opened to speak, but all that escaped was a glass shattering scream. I ran downstairs, tripping over the last few stairs, and I sprained my ankle. To this very day, I haven't touched that solitaire icon, and I'm afraid to delete it. Every time I look at it, all I can see in, in my mind is that evil glare. The grin, the, the mouthing words. I guess it was right. I, I'm just not a winner. My warning for all of you is don't even try to win at solitaire. It's just not worth it.